uh, the question is like, why are you like ading on the corner after you pick a corner? Oh, like just jiggling back and forth like this? Yeah, yeah, uh, this is useless. Uh, it's a bad habit, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it's not not very useful. <laughs> like you, you can peek in and out if you want, but don't like jiggle like that. Like peek in and then like hide instantly if you're not on the guy. Right. Right. Hi, I'm Xbox Lasagna, a gamer who's trying to figure out how to get good at Counter Strike. I've tried all sorts of things, such as stealing gimmick plays from pros, playing in a league, using weird lineups, and uh, learning how to juggle in between rounds. Now I'm trying out coaching. In this video, you're going to see my coach Pianix walk me through a warm-up routine designed to get my busted mechanics up to snuff. This video is part of an ongoing series, so be sure to subscribe for more coaching content. Enjoy the video. So you said you like to really like dial in on the AD and like knowing when to stop, right? Yes. So I like to isolate that movement and actually not uh, move around too much uh, unnecessarily. Okay, so first like counter strafing. So obviously like counter strafing is useful when we are peaking, right? So we mm -hmm. are peaking like this. We want to stop instantly yeah. and be accurate. So I like to move on this line here. I okay. your cross around 90 degrees to the angle. So like not like this, not like this, not like this, like 90 degrees straight here. Mm -hmm. And then basically trying to stop ev at every single bot, but with one movement, okay? You're not doing something like this where you stop here and do another like 10 movements. It's okay. like one and try to stop at the bot not moving your crosshair. Then if you manage to stop at the bot, you burst. If you miss like the movement, you mm -hmm. adjust your crosshair, then burst and then bring it back, okay? okay so it's going to be something like this. Because we want to practice for the real game scenario where we're peeking. Uh, the reason is in a real game when we are peeking, right? And we, let's say, the guy is here. Mm -hmm. We think the guy is here. We peek like this, we stop, and then the guy moves slightly to here. <laughs> yeah. Then we need to, like, adjust, right? We're yes. not going to peek and then do another small movement. Right. It doesn't make sense. So in here, we're kind of practicing this. We're trying to stop at the point. So this is the, like, point where we imagine the guy is. Okay. But he can kind of, like, we can miss. So we adjust, oh, adjust, and burst. And then you go the other side. And you just do this a couple of times, right? Cool. Without moving your crosshair, ideally. So can you try it? Yes. Right okay, let me... Obviously, also, like, one big rule in CS when you're practicing. I saw you kind of skipped it when you were, you were showing me your practice. You don't want to miss, like, almost a single time, you know? The way you need to think about it <laughs> is, like, you want to first, like, stop with a counter strafe. Mm -hmm. And then only when you mentally check this box in your head that you are on the guy, only then you shoot, okay? Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, here you should do a small, yeah, exactly. and burst, always. Oh, <laughs> I yeah, did it's it. okay, you don't go back, don't go back if you miss, it's okay. okay. The here was too fast. Yep. It was pre-fire. Yeah, really good. Go to the left okay. now. Yeah, really good. And then you obviously, like, you can stop because you're good. Mm -hmm. uh, so then you would be doing it for a couple of times and going faster and faster and faster until you, like, obviously keeping the accuracy 100% or close to 100 so This would be the first one that you're doing. Second one will be a bit more interesting. Okay. So for the second exercise, and you're going to get yourself in the middle of the bots, okay? So you're going to be, like, in the middle of this platform. And now you're going to be spinning around like this. This is going to be... Uh, practicing or adjusting a lot. So you're going to be doing something like this. Okay. You want to spin like this, like do these movements to the left and then mm -hmm. also keep your D button pressed. Okay. This is going to be simulating you basically like clearing a corner, if that makes sense. So I see. You're, okay. you're spinning like that. Then you want to stop in like not on any bot. So you want to stop with a counter strafe, not on any bot. So like this, for example, then you adjust your crosshair to the closest bot and you burst. Okay. So you're moving. Stop. Adjust the crosshair and burst. Then you go the other side, A, and move your mouse to the right. Oh, adjust the crosshair and burst. So you're gonna freestyle then. And like generally, this is not flicking because flicking would be like moving with crosshair and instantly shooting. Yeah, it's right? a smaller. Like it's a smaller movement. Yeah. Uh, so adjustment is like you adjust, then you make sure you're on the guy and you shoot, right? So if adjusting, you can be hundred percent accurate. So like when you get faster and you actually still become accurate, this will look something like this. Like, but still get a good it slow and be precise, right? So then you do it over okay. and over and you just become quick. Yeah, so I'm pressing it's A and generally... moving my mouse in the same direction. 
No, you're pressing D and okay. you're moving your mouse to the left. So you keep spinning your oh, mouse to the left. Oh, okay, like this. Also, you wanna like, yeah, but you're not press. You you keep pressing D. Yeah, keep it pressed all the time. Okay, it's I'm holding it down. Yeah, like this. This is the. Yeah. Okay, so now then you stop I stop with the counter straight, not on any bot. Stop. Yeah, adjust your crosser and burst. But also, you want to move like fast enough with your mouse so that actually doesn't pull you to any direction on the map. So you actually stay in the same spot. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, that's good. You can go the other way if you want, but that's cool. Another important part uh, of like from drilling mechanics is actually practicing versus moving bots. For that, I use fast aim slash reflex map. I don't know if you have it done on it. What what you showed me before was mm. the bots running only straight at you, right? Like straight at you, like this, for example, right? The thing is, in CS, people will more likely strafe than than run into you. Like, mm -hmm. so what you're gonna be doing here? Is you're gonna be following the heads of the bots for like a bit without even like shooting them for like 20 30 seconds just to warm up your tracking motion to just like you know follow the, the head mm -hmm. for a bit in this map you're gonna uncomfortably move your mouse to the sides because in no real scenario you're gonna be tracking for that yeah. long like for, <laughs> before shooting right but you kind of gotta like do it right and then later on you're gonna start shooting but you're gonna start shooting them like very smoothly so you're gonna be like like really like track 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 and then shoot track 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 and then shoot not like f like this so follow follow and then shoot so it has to be like one click after you after you track gotcha pull. so do that first and then we go into how to practice with an AK here yeah okay what you're doing is like clicking you want to be tracking and then clicking without moving your mouse like obviously you can move your mouse slightly but Wait, what sense are you on? Can you remind me? What One, DPI is it? 1.1 at 800. It's not that big. Kind yeah, of. I think I'm just bad at tracking. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Yeah. Uh, this was fine. This was fine too. Like, uh, get out of the habit of instantly moving your mouse out of the guy because sometimes you'll be tracking and you hit like one shot and you don't you miss oh, it. Oh yes, and... okay. Like, you don't want to, like, flick away very panically after, yeah. Like, if you s kill this guy and see another guy, you can you can mm -hmm. very fast, like, switch to him, but just don't flick away randomly. Yes. Yeah, this is fine. Like, this kind of switch is completely fine. Next thing we want to do is with the AK. Uh, give the bots Kevlar. And what you're going to be doing is you're going to be moving and bursting the bots. Because in a real game, you cannot afford to, for example, stand and do something like this. Yeah. Right? Yeah. <laughs> So what's gonna happen is you're gonna have duels between like you're gonna have du duels around some boxes so mm -hmm. you're gonna move like first you know like move around and kill this guy move around just like you were moving on that uh, aztec map that you okay. played right yeah so here you want to do something like this movement stop adjust the crosshair burst movement stop adjust the crosshair burst like do a movement stop, adjust the crosshair burst. Movement stop, adjust the crosshair burst. So even if you're missing, be, be, after every burst you wanna do a strafe, okay? Okay. You don't want to do it too fast, so you're like you don't wanna miss like all the time here. You wanna be very accurate, but if you miss, you do just another movement and burst. So okay. you don't wanna do, you also don't wanna do like couple movements. So do something like this, and okay. then kill. Like you don't wanna do this, right? Yeah. You wanna do like one strafe, so like strafe adjustment. First. Yeah, okay, I'll try Your it. Your turn. Okay. So I... Uh, where's the bot? Okay, strafe. No, 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 you're doing like three strafes, bro. Yeah, now it's good. Wait. Again, two strafes. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I keep going on the same guy if you miss, by the okay. way. Okay. And also one more thing, you can give the bots Kevlar. So like, oh, true. go... Like, yeah, so they actually don't die in the body. Bro, here you did like a strafe to the right and then a strafe <laughs> to the left, right? Yeah, it's, no like, point. it's like subconscious, you want, I, I guess. I want to get you out of this habit of doing like AD before you like shoot. I want you to do one strafe and then like kill. Also, by the way, if you're missing like a couple times, mm -hmm. just slow down the adjustments. So do the strafe, like literally chill for a second, track the guy, and then shoot. I see. 
strafing is, strafing yeah, guys out. are tough. Watch out for this too much of AD. Yeah, this looks okay. This looks fine. So now, and this, in my opinion, are actually all the things that you need to be practicing in CS when it comes to mechanics. Maybe like movement, we can add on top of that later on. Mm -hmm. But this, from the basics, like strafing, then you have like moving your crosshair to the enemies. Then you have moving enemies and you have tracking. And then you combine tracking, movement and adjusting. So like you have all the yeah, that mechanics covers, covered. That covers a and lot then, of it, yeah. Yeah, and then wipe rack covers the position of your crosshair as you're picking an angle right. to remember where the default spots are, right?